Hello, friends and fellow gardeners. It's a rainy day. Let's check our mail. Staying positive. Hey there. Well, we wanted to wish our Garden Paws family the best during these hard times. We hope our games bring you some joy. We couldn't have made that. Uh, it is now without the community. With that, we'd like to send everyone a little gift in Garden Paws. If you'd ever like to chat, the Discord is open. Oh, there we go. A soap bottle, a heart balloon, and some face masks. Oh, that's nice. Oh, and there we go. Out of there. Now, I think what we're going to do is that I, I've been driving everybody crazy with my inventory management in that I, I have not put one dot of thought lately into inventory as uh, as is evident by the chaos that is this place. So I think what we're going to do is take some of the great advice I've been getting in the past bit and we're going to spend a, at least an episode, I'm going to guess it's going to be a couple, just getting completely organized here so that it's going to be a lot easier for us to get at crafting, get at all the things we need to do and take care of everything. So, uh, one good bit of advice, um, Farmer Genie suggested uh, orga setting the, a lot of the crafting tables in a crafting zone and organizing the, ma the materials chest around them. And uh, somebody else noted um, making some better chests would be a good idea. And I agree. We, first thing, let us go actually empty out some of the, <laughs> if we can even, some of the chaos that we have here because we have a lot of stuff in our inventory. Let's empty out some of it so we can move it. Have nothing wanted to go. Uh, repair the fence, deliver the thorn. And is there anything else? Eh, not really. Okay, well, let's go put, put some stuff into these various things if we can. What do we have? We got some silver ore. That's the pies. That's my pie chest is where I keep them. Um, you know how it is. Sometimes you get a hanker. And you want to go to ore chest to find that for sure. Um, right, we were working. We're in the middle of so many quests. It's a little bananas. Okay, let's put these seeds over here. We have these white hydrangea seeds. Don't need to carry those around at the moment. We have wheat up again. How fast does wheat grow? Far too fast. It's incredible how fast wheat appears to grow. Um, we had dandelions and stuff. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, we were waiting on a pile of blue hydrangeas. The, those have not come up. I might get around to uh, planting some more stuff after, but we're not there yet. Um, let's see here. Just dump out a few things, at least, just to make this a little bit easier. We have far too much wheat on hand. We finished feeding our critters, so we'll, we'll leave it at that. Oh, there we, we can. Now yeah, we can't even dump all of that in here. All right, that gives us a few slots to work with, and boy, oh boy. Okay, there we go, dandelion. You can go here, excess, no, you can't go there. We, I know we have duplicates and things like that as well, so we have some, it's a little silly at the moment, but let's, let's clear some of this stuff into our upper region. Um, make this all oh, make sense. I may have to cut down some more wood. I have a funny feeling. And then let's go and uh, see what we can do for crafting chests and all that. Now, I don't know if we can do that on this. Which one we do it with? <laughs> let's see. Wooden trough. I don't need a wooden trough. It might be on my personal one. Let's see which one we can do there. It might, Or it might be at the wood one. That would make the most sense, but you never know. Um, yeah, we don't want a small chest. I think we're done with that. We need the bigger ones for sure. All right, so let's go see what we have going on here. There we go, medium chests or large chests. So we can craft the large chest. I don't have any of those. The hold of the 20 items, 12 items. Oh my gosh. All right, well, that is a thing. Uh, I don't know how much wood. Yeah, I need to get a little bit more wood already. Okay, so let's go get a, let's cut down some stuff. At least we have a direction with what we're doing here. So we'll get what we need and uh, we'll get a few large chests made. That'll be the first order of the day. And with that, then we'll be able to, uh, at least 20, 20 inventory is way better as well. We'll be a lot more efficient. I think we get to the point, um, with these quests now where, where there's so much crafting and it's 
it it requires more complex stuff and a lot of uh yeah it it <laughs> being more organized would definitely help a lot i d i think it's uh the also getting to the point where i'm wasting a lot of time hunting for things when it should really be at hand uh, it'll be good it's like in stardew valley i think once i got the farm organized finally after much chaos it was just a lot easier to get things done less friction it's like getting your house cleaned. It's like spring cleaning. Every once in a while, you got to do it. I hate doing it, and I think I put it off far too long. I think the interesting part with games, uh, I think I replied to a few people with it, is I always find you... I don't have any conception of how much inventory is in a game until you've gone like pretty much a year through a game. And then you you kind of have a kind of a sense then of like, okay, what's the extent of the inventory? This game especially struck me with the variety of things in it i was having a hard time really understanding how we're appreciating how vast it was i thought okay well are we done now and they keep adding things <laughs> so every time i think i've got a handle on the inventory size that starts expanding but i think as we get some big chests built um that will make things a little bit easier because that's that's almost doubling every bit that we currently have why yeah interesting why maybe pick that up all right let's float on down over here there's a few little shrubs up here we'll take these there we go skip the blueberry one there we are purple bell I, I again yeah, I'll grab it and throw it in my chest, but I don't I don't even know. I don't even know what I really need. Uh you know we'll land down here. There we are. Alright. There we go. And the one thing I'll I think I'm already noticing. I, uh, right before recording here, oh, I'm all out of energy for the day, am I? Do I have anything? I got my pies. I think I may consume one of those. Yeah, that's, those things are absurd. Um, I ended up, I upgraded my graphics card this morning, or this afternoon, before recording here, and definitely makes a difference. Uh, it definitely sounds I'm uh, running on you know really nice settings and it definitely sounds less like a jet taking off than it did previously so that's that's very nice hopefully that'll help out on a lot of things wasn't the uh, terrible but definitely after running this game for an you know an hour or an hour and a half um, would find it you know any of the indie games I think uh, those smaller titles I tend to find run a little bit hotter um, well I mean AAA games would as well but like, you know, the difference between, say, like a Stardew Valley and, and this or some of them, it's a marked difference. Any of the 3D games tend to get pretty, cook pretty good. So that should hopefully uh, make it easier to uh, sit down and, and do a big batch of recordings and, and do this without me worrying about pancaking something. <laughs> um, not to say this game is, this game runs very nicely. I think it's it's only getting better and better. Uh, that is a shrub. Okay. I was worried that I'm hitting blueberry bushes as well. After that first hit. Okay. So what are we... We've got a lot of wood. Okay, yeah, yeah you know, I think I'll probably stop pretty quick here. My objective was basically get enough that I can just make... I don't even know how many I want to make. Um... The flower chests are good. We can reuse those. Um, there's certain other chests I'd like more of. The oh, I definitely want to keep a, a nice one for the animal goods. Um, ideally, I guess keep one chest for that. One big chest for food, or two chests for food would be good. Because the food... Okay, that's fine. The food situation, not adequate. And uh, then the miscellaneous, like the ores, um, th this ore chest is just, it's simply not big enough. I guess I could build another one of those. The, the nice part, oh, I have, I do have more here. <laughs> That's a stone chest. 
I think I might keep a literal stone crate and then keep like another one for other stuff. Maybe a bigger chest. What was this one? Four by four. So it's a 16. That's not the worst, really. The stone crate. And the nice part about them, the ones that are uh, have a visual cue is that you do know what you've got going into them, which I do kind of, I appreciate that. Those do look good. Um, the fish need their own gigantic chest. That is, see, that is four by five. That is a large chest. So I do need at least a couple of those. Um, yeah, that random chest is. So the flower storage, that's working. And so I do have several large chests, don't I? Yeah. Now, and then I've got to label these. I see the pencil on those ones. Okay, so... Let's see here. And the food, I would like a distinctive food chest. So let's do that. Let's get a food chest going. Okay, so we've got a food chest. Now, I think I'm going to... Um, bum, 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 bum. Where do we want to have our whole crafting? I think I should lay out some crafting benches back here. I like having it all behind the house. It does look a little bit nicer. Like moving this one, for instance. Uh, these would be good to get out of here. And uh, remove workbench and also remove furniture workbench. Okay. Now let's put these back here. Okay. Workbench and furniture workbench. Uh, well, I guess we'll move you. There we go. Okay, now how do we want this to... Is it this way? I can't tell which way is which. I think it's that way. Now, hmm, I guess I, if I want to go straight across, get a sense. I want to leave a little alley here, but I want this to... Let's walk over to... Yeah, oh wow, we can go quite a ways in, can't we? Ah, interesting, okay. And then this one here. Can we go right beside it? Okay, and... Now again, I don't know if I want to have... Maybe a chest in beside it. Um, this one as well, we'll take that and we'll, we'll put that down, let's see. Okay, so same deal here, maybe a chest in between, or a, or a wood rack or something. Okay, then we'll grab this, and then we'll put that maybe... Oh wow. Okay, so we'll put this thing. Hmm. I think I might put this one over here and then I know really what it is. That looks good. Alright, now workbench. Workbench. Yeah, it would be It's funny that they don't and then you can't relabel these. So it's interesting because I don't know. I yeah, one's a workbench. I don't, these two seem to duplicate a lot of functionality, except they don't. <laughs> I don't. I really don't understand the difference. And this one we know is the woodworking bench. It doesn't. Yeah, it doesn't say woodworking bench. Interesting. Until you go to your hammer, that one says furniture, workbench, furniture, storage workbench. I see, that was a, purely a storage. This one is a furniture workbench. Huh. I wonder if I... Well, I know these are all kind of my wood and crafting ones, so I think we're okay with that. Now, I do think I'm going to leave my cooking stuff over here. Um, let's see. Uh, no, not yet. What we'll do, maybe, is we will hold off on that, and I'm going to build a... Do, do, do. I'm trying to think of where I want to put. Well, let's get our stove here. And we'll put that down over here. And we'll put our, let's see, we're gonna definitely burn our house down with this. Okay, so let's get you like right here, I think. 
that's looking good. Now in the middle, I do want to get a couple of nice chests. So I think, um, I think I'm going to, yeah, I think I'm going to do this. There we go. Oh, okay, that was fine. That worked out just fine. No, oh, uh, there we are. Now let's put uh, the hinges in the back. I want to make sure this looks right. And I have to maybe get rid of this other thing first. Okay. Let's get our hammer out. Remove churn. Okay, there we are. And then we can go back into placing this. Oh. There we are. Okay. That looks good. Now let's move this thing. No, uh, let's go back into our hammer. Oh, we had dough in it. All right, well, we don't anymore. Um, let's grab our... Where did it go? Oh, we have we have not picked it up. Okay. Pick up cooking station. That's the one we want. Okay. You know, what you can do now that we've got this thing here, let's do this. And then we can put um, these wooden crates. I don't know that I needed... I got planters. I don't think I needed crates. Oh, you can't put those in. It is literally just wood. Okay. Totally good. Okay, so let's put this thing down over here. And tilt you a little bit. Okay, we'll put that there. And... I think we'll put down, it might be useful to have another one of these chests, I think. I can put the churn maybe like right there, it's kind of off to the side. Okay, so... Um, Okay, we'll grab some food, and we'll start dumping this stuff in here. This is going to help us significantly, I think, get a couple of good food chests going. We'll get rid of these tiny little chests. I can just sell these, even. There we go. Let's see. No, I didn't want that going in there. I think I'll keep my my pie. Now one thing I should probably how much do we have? We have thirty thousand dollars. Did I need forty, I think, for my tree farm upgrade? I really do want to do that just to get that out of my uh let's get off the crate there. Okay, um let's see here. Cause what I was thinking I would like to do as well is get the uh the auto buyer um here locally so that I can do uh, um, we can do more uh, selling of stuff so I can get rid of like you know simple things so that's a medium chest um, I guess that what is it what are these ones here oh, uh, that's a small chest Wow okay so even even the medium chest would be actually an improvement on these Wow oh. Okay, oh, there we are. All right. So what I got, yeah, I mean, these things are hopeless. So I do need, I want a chest to, like with all of that stuff close by, I think my sales pit. Maybe I'll put it over here. Then I'll have a, a nice medium sized chest with things I just want to sell. Because that way we know what we're going to be working with, right? Um, although, to be fair, I could really, you know, if we're building stuff, let's just build a big chest and, and do that. We're going to use them, or we'll end up selling them, so there's no harm in making it. So let's grab ourselves some wood. Okay, and then let's get bailed in here. Oh. Okay, we've got ourselves a large chest. Now let's craft up the, the precursors. Okay. 
they take up a few resources, that's for sure. All right. Let's jet on over here. So hopefully, uh, you know, where do I want to put them, really? Yeah, I guess I could put it right here. The, the idea behind this one is just it really is, like, accessible and obvious. Yeah, that's probably good. Beautiful. Okay, so now I'll put things in here that we want to ditch. Like, uh, bug, well, like fish bait. Because I have, like, far too much of it. And, yeah, like this mess. <laughs> I'm going to do, like, a, oh, because what I'll do is I'll just set the, this sells for nothing, but I want to get rid of it. So we'll set up, um, set up a shop with that. And then, uh, we'll auto sell, hopefully. I'll set up a, a get whatever, the little merchant person that will come and work with us. And then, uh, that will help get all that done. We won't have to do it. I don't mind them taking a cut. I think especially as we get financially to a point where it's not going to really matter anymore. Uh, okay. And you. All right, let's pop that over. This really isn't that uh, time consuming. It's just more tedious than anything. Oop, F. Do I have... Okay, and then the... I guess the small insects. I should turn it all into fishing bait, really. Can I do that here? Yes, I can. Okay. Do I have any left? There we go. Okay. Now, how much space do I have left in this large chest? Wow, that's a lot of fish bait. A little ridiculous. <laughs> Just a little. But we got rid of a lot of that. Um, okay, I'm going to leave those. Oh, no, I'm not. I'm going to take this. I think that's going to fill up. I'm going to have like a whole chest of fish bait. <laughs> like, totally ridiculous. Let's craft this up again. Yep, we're we going to have... I think that's exactly... Yeah, I've got a little bit left. Wowzers. All right. Yeah, 2200 already. That's how fast the today has gone. Okay, I'm going to get another second big chest that we can get going for... Um, Sand and other miscellany. Because I'm not going to smelt all that down to glass. I don't think there's any way I'm doing that. I mean, it might be cost effective for me to do that, but I don't think that's happening. Um, let's see here. We've got... There we go. Craft another one of those. Very nice. And dump the wood back. It's almost time to go to sleep. Well, we got, I think we got a start. I'm feeling good about a start. Let's do you. And I, I was also reminded, <laughs> I can't believe I totally forgot uh, that we can also milk uh, the goat, I believe. And uh, that, I thank you for the reminder of this. I completely forgot we could do that. Let's go and hit Bessie up. Hey, Bessie. Thank you. We'll leave all the plops. I think we're good on plops. Oh, there's a golden egg there. Oh, and go wool. Uh, okay, auto deposit. Yeah, there we go, milk code. And then how about this one? There we go. There, the uh, this auto deposit thing here is problematic in that it keeps wanting to e activate that. Okay, so let's now go and so yeah, I'm gonna have to move all this to my food one as well. I think um, the egg one that's fine. I think the animal products, or I knew uh, maybe I just need two animal products chests, and then we can uh, we'll be happy. Let's see here. Um, okay, cow milk. That's good. We got three. That 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 would have resolved. Oh, so it's goat milk. It's different. Aha. Oh, that's excellent. I'm sure it's all compatible. Our cooking will be fine. Very nice. All right. Well, we will see you all next time. We'll continue on here. I have no idea how long this is going to take, but we're getting there. See you then. Bye-bye.